Hey guys, welcome to day two of the coach sneak peek. So today I want to talk to you guys a little bit about what I do on a day-to-day -day basis as a coach. This will give you guys a bit of a gauge on how much time you're going to need to spend and basically what we do as a coach. So because this business is about helping people, 80% of the time that I spend on my business is about meeting and reaching out to new people. Um, I do this, my favorite way of doing this is through the social media network, um, Instagram. How I use Instagram is I go on there every day and I will search hashtags that relate to my niche market to find people to start a conversation with. So for example, I have an 11 month old, so I'll see, search the hashtag 11 month old and I'm going to go comment on people's photos that um, have 11 month olds and um, I will just talk to them about you know whatever their photo is, get to know them a little bit and say, hey, are you on Facebook? And if they say yes, we will start being friends on Facebook, and I'll message them, get to know them a little bit about their family, their occupation, their recreation. And then I usually just say, hey, you know, aside from being a teacher, I am an online health and fitness coach. I help women um, meet their health and fitness goals, um, work on nutrition, and just get um, to a healthier state in life so that they can feel more energy and have time to run around with those little kiddos. Would you be interested in joining a group of mine? Um, and we have different groups that go on like clean eating challenges and challenge groups, which I'll talk about in a second. But basically, I'm just spending time reaching out and meeting new people. At first, this seemed really scary to me, but when I started doing it, I realized how um, receptive people really are and thankful that um, you are taking the time to reach out to them. So as I got over my fear, um, I really started to see a big change in my business. And again, I was meeting more people and getting a chance to help change lives. Um, the other side of my business, like I mentioned before, is we run challenge teams and clean eating groups. So basically, a clean eating group is a great way to get people who you met through Instagram or Facebook or maybe old high school friends or even just your general friends in life maybe interested in health and fitness if you're not quite ready to invite them to a challenge team, which I'll talk about in a second. So with the clean eating group, our coaches organization puts this together, but basically you get to invite your friends to be part of a five-day online challenge group where they're going to get full meal plans grocery list, recipe guides, and daily support and accountability. And we pack these groups and they're super fun. Um, people usually lose between three to five pounds and get an introduction to what it means to eat healthy. And we sometimes post little workouts for, the, get to, for them to get involved with as well. Once these clean eating challenges are done, a lot of times people are really interested in starting a workout program or continuing with their nutrition. So we have 30 day challenges. These challenge groups are usually between 8 and 12 people. Um, as coaches, again, we put them on together as a team. Um, they are, everybody in the group does a beach body workout. They um, work on their nutrition. We provide meal plans for them. And we're all replacing one meal a day with Shakeology. These challenge groups, um, Beachbody puts out amazing challenge packs that get the customers a workout in Shakeology at a discounted price. And so this is usually where we make a lot of our commissions as we're inviting people to be part of these groups and we make um, sales off of the packages that they buy, but then it's not just that we're selling the packages, we're giving them this whole support system along the way, which I love about being a coach. So they're getting daily accountability that they check into this group with, they're doing this with other people who are in their same position, um, and we're walking alongside with them so that it's not just a workout program that comes, ships to them, and then we leave them alone and they have you know no direction. So these challenge teams are how I was able to succeed in my fitness, um, and a lot of the other coaches in our group, same thing. They really struggled with their fitness until they were part of a challenge team. So aside from doing clean eating groups and challenge groups and meeting new clients, um, over time, you get to help bring other coaches onto the team who get to invite their friends to be a part of this so that we can really spread um, the word and end the trend to obesity. So usually what I do is anybody who in my challenge group has really shown amazing success and starts motivating other people in the group, I just kind of talk to them and like, hey, I don't know if you've ever been interested in this, but you did an amazing job in this challenge team um, supporting and encouraging other people. Have you ever considered being a coach? and we will um, talk to them about coaching. We'll invite them to one of these sneak peeks that you're a part of and bring them onto our team so that we can, again, like I said, spread the news, spread the excitement about being healthy, working out, um, having better nutrition and helping end the trend of obesity. So um, that's kind of just what a day in a life of a coach is. If you have any additional questions, please comment below this video. We'd love to hear your thoughts, even if you don't have questions. Um, is this what you thought a coach was? Um, did you maybe think it was something different? And again, if you have any other questions. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.